Free gift now available. Stay tuned to the end to find out how. Hi, this message is for Taurus. This is for December 2020 in the area of love. Remember to take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Blah, blah, blah. You should know the deal. Taurus, December 2020 in the area of love. Let's see what your situation is, Taurus. You have the chariot in reverse. Okay, so perhaps you reconciled with someone and it is not working out the way you thought it might. They are the ace of swords, yeah. So I feel as though there might have been some disconnect in the past with this person and then there was a reconciliation and they might have been the, they might have came in to try and reconcile with you and you might have gone, gone forward with that against your better judgment and now it's not working out. But they came in and they were so pushy about it that you kind of just like went with it for some reason. Let's see what's going on in your head. You have the King of Pentacles. Okay. So this might be a situation in which, you know, you, the two of you split and then you started doing really well, right? You had this glow up, you, you got a new job, uh, you, or you started hanging out with new people or, you know, there were new love interests in your life. This person saw that, panicked and came right back in really quick. So now there's this reconciliation situation and it is not quite working out let's see what your desires are taurus two of cups you do there was love here there was this partnership here and part of you really wanted this to work out and part of you still wants this to work out you still want this to work out which is why you're holding on let's see what their desires are Nine of Cups. Okay, they want it to work out too. All right, there are genuine feelings there. There are genuine feelings there, even if, you know, there when they came in, it was, it was, I feel as though there were some jealousy, ego issues there that was the catalyst for that, for that, them coming back in. However, there is genuine love there because look, you have this Two of Cups and they have this Nine of Cups. You are their wish fulfillment and they are your twin flame let's see what your challenges are you have the eight of pentacles in reverse okay so now in that one of the challenges here is it, the reason you feel as though it's not working out is as soon as they came back in now once again less focus was going on in your career and the other aspects of of your life so they left, you started focusing on yourself, doing really well. They panicked and came running back in and uh, now you have to take away again. You feel as though you're taking away again from focusing on yourself, despite wanting it to work out with this person, despite the fact that they want it to work out as well. And that is a challenge for you, that balance, all right? Their challenge, they have the Six of Swords they want to move forward with you, but I feel as though the maturity level just isn't there. You know, you start focusing on yourself, you're doing good, but they, they are not at that same level that you're at maturity wise, you know, in terms of a commitment, in terms of really creating this wish fulfillment. And that could be one of the reasons that this didn't work out in the first place. It feels as though it might be a matter of timing here even though there is love here. Let's see what your overall outcome is, Taurus. You've got the Five of Swords as your overall outcome. Let's see what their overall outcome is. They got the Devil. So you could be dealing with the Capricorn. You know, the chariot, we have the chariot in reverse at the bottom of the um, reading here, and that's Cancer. They are going to let their fears and their insecurities get the best of them here. Because what's going to happen is you are going to pull back and continue focusing on your career and focus on yourself. You are, I feel as though it's like, you know, this is very much a card of ego, right? But I don't think this is, 
in your case, in this reading, I don't feel as though this is necessarily a bad thing because you are going to uh, pull back a little bit to focus on your coins, just as you were doing before they came back into the picture because you built something here and you don't necessarily wanna let that go and who can blame you? And as a result of that, they're going to fall back in this mindset of, insecurity and fear, which is kind of what led to the demise of this in the first place. It's, I feel as though this is a cycle here. This is a cycle and you're, you're going through it yet again. All right. You might just need to break the cycle. Let's see what the overall outcome, potential outcome could be here. The three of cups in reverse. Yeah, okay, so this three cups in reverse could represent a third party situation, right? But a third party situation doesn't necessarily mean like a third person. And I definitely feel as though in this case, it's your work or your life, something, something going on in your life that you established during the time that the two of you split and you want to still keep that part of your life. And that's going to lead to this fear and insecurity on the, on their part. Are the two of you going to get through it? Possibly. I feel as though some real communication needs to take place and there needs to be new perspectives here on their part, new perspective and uh, some real compromise if you want to make it work with this particular person, which it seems like you do. And so do they. So there's work to be done here if you want to go forward, right? It seems like you do because look, you, you have the two of cups, they have the nine of cups, all right? Because this, uh, this third party, your life, the things you've been working on, that is what is getting in the way, so to speak. Although based on this, I can't say I blame you. All right, Taurus? So like, share, comment, subscribe, and Stay tuned to learn how to get your free gift. All right, thanks, bye. Hi guys, so now for the part you have waited for, the free gift. I have a book available, an ebook available on the Amazon Kindle store, the Tarotverse Fun Rise to Learn Tarot, and I am offering a portion of the book for free today for you. There is a link in the description down below where you can download that portion of the book. The book is rhymes for all 78 tarot cards. It also has uh, zodiac correspondences and time of year and planet correspondences. And the best part is there is the rhymes are designed to help you learn the tarot cards quickly, easily, and in a fun, unique way. I'm really excited about this book and I'm glad to share this with you. So go check it out, download it, and if you enjoy it, please check out my book on the Kindle store. It is available today. Thanks, bye.